the one in which we live today was to bring about an imbalance of life. It told us how the people would lose their sense of purpose and that the children would leave the teachings of our traditions. Many people feel this is how it is on our reservation today. We feel trapped by the alcohol and drugs that surround us. We see our parents self-destruct and we began to believe that this must be our tradition too. We are living in an artificial world filled with fake wars, fake languages, fake everything. We are losing our ways just as the teaching of the players said would happen. We are heading in a downward spiral towards the destruction of our nation. It is here that the way of the sun fire falls to us. If the Anishinaabe stay on the path of physical disease and despair, the ultimate death of Native sovereignty and Native identity will be realized. But there is a choice. Hey cousin, welcome to the Red Road. Anin, I'm waiting for you. Do you guys want to party? Who are you? We're about keeping it real. Walking the red path. Ani and AJ, I am. You don't look so good. I'm good, man. Down to party with us or what? We're not about partying. Not like that, anyways. You have other choices. Here, I have something to If we look to the sky, the answer to who we are will come to us in the faces of friends, family honor and peace. The sky is the limit. Don't be afraid to go beyond. Who am I? No, well, I'm Nishnabe. No, this is my Nishnabe life. Our elders have given us the gift of believing in ourselves. We are the seventh generation. We need to get out there and meet our young people and start guiding them and teaching them. By listening to the elders' words and carrying the mega shell, there is an opportunity to create a way of life that is filled with the beauty of the Anishinaabe way. Miigwech.